The purpose of this experiment is to find out whether trucks make a difference during an earthquake to a bridge. We argue about this with computer methods. This test is going to answer the question once and for all. Well, there are certainly other um, laboratories in the United States that have shake tables. We are unique because we have four of them and we can control them to all work together. Well, the bridge is 145 feet long and it has an 80 foot radius, which makes it the largest model we have ever tested here. And in fact, this bridge couldn't be tested anywhere else in the world at this size. It weighs 160 tons. But these projects take a long time to design, uh, do all the planning, all the preparatory work. There are other aspects of this project, apart from its physical size, is the number of people working on the project. We have eight graduate students, six of whom are doing doctorates and two are doing master's degrees. I am a graduate student working on getting my master's degree and my part of this project is the live load portion, which is the trucks on the bridge. We are trying to find out how the vehicle suspension system will interact with the bridge during an earthquake to see if it will help or hinder. There's a lot of problem solving. It's figuring out how to lift trucks up onto a bridge or how are we going to instrument them so that we can get the information we need. We choose one earthquake. It's a real earthquake recorded in Southern California, the Northridge earthquake, 1994. And we start with a fraction of that earthquake and we go really slowly and then it's a 10% and then 20% just to see how everything is working together, the bridges and the trucks and then we, we work all the way up and we will go beyond that particular earthquake which will be uh, the 200% run and, and uh, maybe even to 3 or 400% of that earthquake. It really does depend on how the bridge behaves with the trucks sitting on it. And it's clear that this bridge has a tremendous amount of resilience, that we can really punish it a lot and it still hangs together. And one of the preliminary conclusions we have is that for small earthquakes, the trucks help a lot. But today the trucks were making it worse, aggravating it. There's no other lab in the country like this, so it's been a lot of fun. And it's exciting when you get to shake things. <laughs>